Well, folks, here's some, uh, here's some trivia for you. Who won the first ever Grammy in the rap category? You all know who that was? It was in 1989, and it was DJ Jazzy Jeff and the Fresh Prince. That Fresh Prince, of course, being Will Smith, but he will even tell you that the star of that duo was DJ Jazzy Jeff. Yes, he's a legendary producer who is now sitting down to reflect on his career, the importance of DJs to the history of hip hop, and the buzz surrounding the new Bel Air series. People don't understand the, the actual job of a DJ. There's a lot of people that think that you're just up there playing records. We got what you want. You are the person that sets the tone and you feel the energy of the room. So I'm seven years old playing Herbie Hancock records because there's something about this music that makes me feel a certain way. So I wanted to learn how to get everything that was inside of me out. There's no need to argue, parents just don't understand. Even though you started doing something because you love it, it does not mean that you don't put in the work. I remember my mom calling me at the studio asking me to take her to the supermarket. And I had baby face in the studio. And I was like, mom, I can't. You know, I'm, I have a client here. The day that I met Will, Will looked me in my face and said, I want to be a movie star. And OK, now you put it out there. Now you got to do the actions to follow me. How do you do? I'm Mr. Banks. You got that right. <laughs> My main issue was I don't want to get derailed from what my plan is. I really want to try to produce records for other people. Just because I did the TV show doesn't mean that you don't do that. It actually kind of helped. Just think, if it doesn't work out, it could jeopardize our friendship. I'm willing to take that risk. <laughs> I'm still processing what happened on The Fresh Prince and how this became such a huge cultural movement big enough that there's a reboot of it. Thank you for your time, Jess. Thank you for your money, Phil. I don't think that they could have done a better job at taking what we did in the 90s and moving it to 2022. If the Banks family were real, this is exactly how they would be. Well, also, I'm a Lakeham, homie. Welcome to Cali. When you're younger, you kind of stick to your guns a little bit more than you should. You're just kind of like, is this or nothing? And you get older, you kind of learn that you can do multiple things. I really enjoy all of it because it's so many different things that it's very hard to get bored doing. And there are millions and millions of records out there that you can play. And if your job is to take people on a journey, it's my job to search for those Easter eggs that give you that moment that when you walk out of the club, you're just saying, I cannot believe he played that. This isn't the type of job that you retire. This is to the death. What is their secret? He and Will Smith are aging beautifully, aren't they? Uh <laughs> Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.